I, I didn't. Nope. Mm -mm. Every single day. Hey guys, Bethy B here on this uh, beautiful rainy Sunday. I mean, you gotta love that. The fact that uh, um, this whole day has been shot to heck. I got up early this morning. <clears throat> I really don't have a story for this this weekend. Um, I know I, I usually do story time Saturday or Sunday, um, as the case may be. But yesterday um, was coach Saturday um, where I had to coach game and that just completely um, shot my whole day. Although it was really awesome. My girls did really great and um, we won our football game. So, eh. But I just didn't feel like making a video yesterday. And I was going to do it with like a story time Sunday, but like, um, here I am. Um, I really don't have a story. Um, so I'm just going to vlog. Um, and I'm not that great at it. I went out this early this morning, um, me and Emily did, to see if we could find some more stuff in some dumpsters. And we came up empty. Like, this was a horrible day for dumpster diving. Just nothing but boxes and nothing. Um, and uh, this whole week hasn't been very good for the dumpsters. Um, and it's... It stinks, though, because I, I drive, you know, like, I don't have an Ulta around me. Um, I actually drive to an Ulta um, to go and um, uh, dumpster dive. So um, when I get there and there's nothing in the dumpster, that might be why I'm a little salty sometimes. Um, and it's kind of disheartening to, you know, jump in and there not be nothing but soup or, or like, you know, curling irons that are beat to heck. But, you know, this week wasn't that bad. I got my envelopes for my giveaways, and I'm going to be mailing that stuff out tomorrow. And I have to drive 30 miles to um, the nearest uh, FedEx drop-off um, so that I can um, uh, drop off uh, the thing that uh, Mark Harry decided that couldn't go in a drop-off box, um, and it's less than a pound, and I have to take it to an, a place with employees um, to, like, um, to pack and ship it. Um, and I think that's a bunch of crap. So, you know, I'm, I'm winning on the shipping department here. Um, but, you know, stuff's coming out tomorrow. So it's, it's cool. It's cool. It's fine. It's fine. This is how I am. I, I don't know. Um, everything's hitting at once. <laughs> if everything didn't hit at once, I wouldn't be me. So I was checking my time hop earlier, and I noticed that uh, I have um, been on a diet for the past nine years. Um, how about that? Everybody give me a round of applause for losing like 400 pounds. Over and over and over. I mean, I didn't really lose 400 pounds. I mean, I probably lost the same 20, 25 pounds, maybe 30 pounds um, uh, over and over for the past nine years. I mean, who's with me? You're with me, aren't you? We've all done this. We've all done this. Um, we have lost weight over and over and over. And unless you're super skinny or you're just happy with the weight that you are, um, you're on a diet. You're on a diet all the time. Because that's what we do. We're never happy. We're never happy with how we look. Um, six months from now, I'm probably going to be like, man, I wished I looked like, uh, you know, Bethy B six months ago. And, and right now I'm wishing I would have looked like I did three months ago. So, and then three months ago, I wasn't happy with how I looked then. It's a vicious cycle. But anyway, I digress. So at the beginning of the year, I started to go on the, I went on the keto diet. And um, that is an awesome diet, by the way. I mean, you get to eat your fats, you get to eat protein. I mean, you get all the the bacon and, and the, the coconut oil that you can stand. And you just have to stay away from carbs. I don't know if you know this or not, but carbs are delicious. Carbs are amazing. Carbs are your friend. No, they're not. They're your enemy. They're like that bet, that girlfriend that, uh, that you met in, um, in high school. The one, not your best friend, but the other girl that tried to come in between you and your best friend. That's what carbs are. You don't see it coming. You don't see it coming. You see, like, oh man, it tastes good. These cupcakes and little, little Debbie. Little Debbie is her name that comes in between you and your best friend. You, your best friend being skinny, and there's little Debbie. She wants to screw it up. No more. No more, little Debbie. Mm -mm. So like I said, I've been on a diet for like nine years um, and I've lost the same 30 pounds over and over and over. And it's just like, it's getting old. So like I said, six months of keto and I lost some like 30 some pounds and um, I've gained about 22 of it back um, in two months. That'll make you feel really good, don't it? I mean, seriously. Um, so I've lost, uh, I I've lost hope. Not really. Um, this week I'm going to start eating better. I keep saying that every week, um, and every week I fail, and that was, that's what makes me human. But I like to believe that I'm a part of a community of people out there, of moms, who are so tired of dieting and who are so tired because they're taking their kids here and taking their kids there, sporting events and work, and, and we don't have time to meal prep. I mean, do we? I mean, like, I'm good enough if I, if I get 
a Snickers bar for lunch and I mean, out of control. Let's just say that, it's out of control. So I need to get control. So what I need from you is to let me know in the comments, are you like me? Are you, have you been dieting for the last nine years? I mean, I need to feel like I'm not alone and I know I'm not alone, ladies. I know I'm not alone because we're all there. We're all there. Now it's football season. No one's gonna have time to cook. We're going out to eat, this, that, and the other. I mean, it's just, it's gotta stop. It's a vicious cycle. So maybe this is what I need to do. You know, like years ago, I made myself accountable because like like every week I would put my weight on Facebook and then I would shame myself into losing weight. Um, and then, then it got to be where um, I just made excuses. I'm like, well, this week I gained three pounds, but you know, um, that cake was good. So, and then I just got like numb to it all, but I don't want to shame myself. I want to just, I want to build myself up. I want to build you up. Let's do this together. What do you think? So that's it. Short and sweet this Sunday. Um, just, uh, let me know what you think in the comments. Give me, uh, give me a like, subscribe if you haven't. Um, it can only get better from here. Bye. Every single day.